If you are looking for an easy and quick way of running large language models or LLMs on Apple Silicon and then you want to do local inference with them, then this project Sci LLM is quite good in my humble opinion. I will drop the link to its GitHub repo in video description. But in this video, I am going to give you a run through as what exactly this project is, how it works and its features. I don't have a Mac, unfortunately, or Apple Silicon, so I won't be able to show you. But still, I believe that if you have one, you should give it a try. This Sci LLM simplifies the process of training and running large language models on Apple Silicon by leveraging the MLX framework. If you don't know what MLX is, MLX is an array framework for machine learning research on Apple Silicon, which is created by Apple Machine Learning Research. MLX um, has a Python API that closely follows NumPy. MLX also has fully featured C++, C and Swift APIs, which closely mirror the Python API. So if you have been doing Python programming coding with LLMs on other platforms, then it should be very easy to port it to this MLX. MLX has also got an higher level package like MLX.NN and MLX.Optimizers with APIs that closely follow PyTorch to simplify building more complex model. Another good feature of MLX is that it supports composable function transformation for automatic differentiation, automatic vectorization and computation graph optimization. Computation in MLX are lazy. Arrays are only materialized when needed. Computation graphs in MLX are constructed dynamically. Changing the shape of function arguments does not trigger slow compilation and debugging is simple and very intuitive. And operations can run on any of the supported device, whether it's a CPU or GPU. Coming back to this Sci LLM, as I said, this leverages very heavily this MLX framework. So if you uh, are looking to use it, I would highly suggest you also read through and get comfortable with MLX. It also has built upon the MLS example repo, which the link is in their GitHub repo. And that project introduces additional features specifically designed to enhance LLM operations with MLX in a streamlined package. So with the help of this Sci LLMs, you can load LLMs for chat and training in different formats, whether it is from Hugging Face, PyTorch, GGUF or MLX format. You can also do low rank adaptation training. And you can also do the direct preference optimization training on your own dat custom data set with the help of this. There are a lot of good features around this Sci LLM. And so for example, it, it provides a web app for a seamless chat experience running on local hardware on Apple Silicon. You also get an API server with OpenAI compatible chat endpoints. So you can do chat completions there. It also supports a lot of good model architectures, including Llama, Mistral, Mixtral, Fire2, Gemma, Quentu, Starcoder, DBRX, Cohere, Command R. And these are the models which it supports. As you can see, Llama 3 is already there, which was released two days ago. And I have done quite a lot of videos on it if you're interested. And then you can it supports Llama 2, Mistral, as I said, Code Llama, DBRX, and Cohere. And in the future, it is going to also do a lot of things. For example, you can uh, have repetition uh, penalty fun and friends you can save model to ggf format and then one of my favorite fine tuning technique orpo which combines the supervised fine tuning and um, preference alignment into one step so that you just simply uh, create a orpo format with dpo sort um, on data set and the fine tuning is very very of high quality license is quite good mit license so I would highly suggest that you try it out locally and then if you want, you can distribute it easily. Now the installation is very simple. In order to install it, all you need to do is to pip install scilllm mlx and it is going to install it on your local system. Also for the web application experience, which I was mentioning earlier, it uses Chainlit to provide a front end. And then they also have some videos which you can check out on their GitHub repo. So if you want to start that web app, all you need to do is to git clone it, edit to that directory, install all the requirements and in a familiar way, start your chain rate with the help of Python. Make sure to set your environment variable to load local adapters of a model which you have done with LoRa. 
you can also use it quite easily with CLI all you need to do is to run it through Python and the pass to your model the models which I showed you earlier also uh, you can uh, run this SileLM chat with Gemma 2 on MacBook Air with only 16 GB of memory so that's how low the footprint is and then you can run the API server with basic functionality with this command if you want to do the lot of fine tuning all you need to do is to just simply specify the adapter with scilm.lora and for dpu just uh, you know change it to d dot dpu and it is going to convert it to dpu and then you can also convert the model while converging um, while merging the adapters or quantizing the weights this is this is how simple it is and then you can uh, simply quantize the model serially in 4 bit here in this example and even without loading into your uh, memory fully and then this is how you can generate a text or inference very easy and these are full examples of lot of fine tuning dpu fine tuning and then a lot of other things in the repo as you can see here so all in all a really good project i wish i would have access to the apple silicon um, platform and i would love to show you this but try it out let me know your experience i will drop the link of this github repo in video description i hope that you enjoyed it if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel and if you're already subscribed then please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching